<laughs> you caught me falling over. I was making sure my mic was on. Every time, I keep starting my videos, and then I realize, um, like, am I on? And I'm never on. I always forget to turn on, but hey, what's up? Happy Saturday. Thanks for coming to Dina Matrano Fit. Today, we've got our Fit Strength class. We just got through doing Fit Fix, which is why my, like, my face looks so awesome right now. Because <laughs> everything, like, ran. All right, but, um, yeah, so Fit Strength. Make sure you get your mat. Always water, always a towel, always your A game, okay? Hi, Kristen. You wanna make sure you've got a few different sets of weights. I'm working with eights and tens today. You know, I was gonna go 15, but like, I'm not really feeling it, all right? So I'm gonna keep it real today, all right? Eights and tens, because I don't, we don't injure ourselves, right? Remember what I told you guys, it's okay to push, it's okay to get uncomfortable, but not to the point of injury, okay? And I feel like if I do 15s today, I'd probably hurt myself because um, I don't know if you know my dogs, but they together weigh over like 200 pounds and like walking them is a shoulder impingement when they see a squirrel and start to chase them. Yeah, so I gotta take it easy on that shoulder today. <laughs> but anyways, hey, so grab your weights. I'm gonna get the music going, we're gonna get started. If you're with me, just start doing some jumping jacks. You don't wanna jump, just go with some heels. You wanna do a little cabbage patch in. You wanna do a little like run a man, just go for it. Let me get the music. All right, so I hope everyone's doing awesome. Thank you so much for showing up. What do I tell you all the time? That's the hot pot. That is the hot pot. Showing up's the hot pot. Once we're here, we're like rock stars, right? So we're gonna start warming up. Flat back comes down. Roll up just halfway. All right, so we wanna just get that little C curve, get that little tuck right there. Inhale, flat back comes down. Roll up, halfway, uh, right there. So spine long and then round out, okay? Two more. Awesome team, happy Saturday. We're gonna get this move and take it up. Give me some heel jacks right here, go. Just heels, just heels. Yeah, and you can move those arms. All right, we just wanna make sure everything's loose. Everything's loose, right? <laughs> Especially those hips, they get so tight. All right, bring those arms up with you now. Option one, you're standing right here. Option two, give me a jack. Give me a little jack, what's up, what's up? So listen, if you're looking at yourself in the mirror, your arms should be blurry. Yeah, because you're pushing up and down. Let's go, double jack, take it up, go. Now they're not blurry. Now there's no blur on those arms. Up and down, come on. You're jumping on a sheet of glass, remember, we don't want to break it. So use control, strong core, tight abs, right? Faster go. Uh -huh. Yep, there's the blur. Woo -hoo. Squeeze that butt nice and tight. Who's got eight? I got eight. Four, three, double, just hold, go. Yeah, out and in. Option, remember, just stepping, okay? Right here. What did you say? You wanna do one more set? Kristen, is that what you said? Yeah? Let's go, come on. Can you bounce with me? Bounce with me. Blurry photos right here. Ow, eight. Glutes nice and tight. Heart rate's up, yes. Squat down right here, go. Awesome. All right, squeeze that bum nice and tight. Now remember, we're sitting back in the chair. We're picking up a dollar bill, right? We're hovering our bum over a skeevy toilet bowl. Take it down, hold free. We don't wanna let our butt touch that toilet bowl, right? Skeevy, skeevy outhouse. So this is how you kind of remember to keep those, the weight of your body heavy in your heels. Because look it, if you did a squat like this and you were trying to use a skeevy toilet bowl, what are you gonna do? You're gonna pee all over yourself, all right? So get your hips back. Make sense? Make, that makes sense, right? Yeah, of course. Take it to the Ow. Can you bounce it to bounce with me? Coming up. Now, I don't want you going like, coming like this. Ugh. Okay? But squeeze that bum. You know what? The tight of that bum gets, did you know? A little FYI. A little Saturday fact check for you today. The tighter those glutes are, the more those hips come open. Four more. Right? What were those after school specials? And they had that like, stay down close. What was that after school special? Like, and now you know. And they've had that star flying by. I'm gonna have to do a little Google check after this workout. Cause you know it's gonna bug me all day. Last four. Ready? Open side to side, lunge. Left, right. Good. So those inner thighs nice and long. Heavy in your heels. Stay nice and low and control. Control, yeah. Strong core. Let's go. Double here. Right side. 
up. That's kind of bugged me now. What the hell is that after school special thing called? When they give you that little bit of information, like... Tempo, girl. Yeah. It's gonna aggravate me. Sue Cullen, you with me still? Can you, like, get on that and Google it? Find me what that was. Seven. So you guys who maybe don't know me personally, you already understand I don't take myself seriously. Take it over to I do take you seriously. I take your workout seriously. Okay? And I completely overcoach when I have you guys on a screen like this because I can't see you. So I want to make sure you're doing it properly. Take it singles back and forth. Go. Ow, why are we doing all these legs warm, huh? Why are we getting these legs so warm? I don't know. Maybe some squats, some sumo, some goblets. I don't know. Let's see what we got. Take it up right here. Nice job. Flat back. Shoulders back. Nice job, you guys. Inhale as arms up nice and high. Let it rain. Coming down. One more time. Reach and rain. Nice. Grab your weights. Grab your band. I love this song. You like this song? Right here. We got this. If you don't got it, don't worry. You don't need it. Well, I mean, you can go out and get one. If you guys live close to me, I can leave them in my mailbox for you. Come by, okay? So what this is going to do is create a lot of outer thigh resistance. Now remember, you don't have it, that's okay. Weights right here. We're down two, up two. Now what this band is going to do also, for a lot of us that tend to have like this going on in our legs, right? Have that little turn in. This is going to help you to remember. You guys keep going two counts. This band will help your thighs to remember to keep your knees, well, uh, knees forward and tracking your toes. All right, so these outer thighs are gonna get so much strength that even without the band, when you start to do your squats, you're gonna start to stop doing this, caving in, okay? Muscle has memory. Take a tempo, come down and up, right there. Down, up, yeah. So you get a little tension on that band, right? We're not pushing out like this. We're not sinking in like that. We're keeping that resistance isometrically contracted. Yes, four. And it's above your kneecaps on three. Nice, now ready? We're gonna do some baggage checking right here. Come down two, drop your luggage, up two. Come down two, pick it up, ow. Right, as soon as this corona is over, I'm hitting the Aruba. So we gotta train that body how to bend with those legs. Heavy heels. All right, you're at the grocery store. Damn, I dropped a can. We bend with our legs, right? Yes, we do. It's not, it's not an option. You don't bend with your back. Down two, squeeze, pull through. Eyes up, chest and chin always up. How's that feeling, you guys? Feel those legs really fired up, yes? One more time, awesome job. Ready? Just give me a little hinge and a roll right here. Make sure you can tap those toes. Okay, so get that back nice and long. Now you're gonna still keep some tension on those outer thighs. We're not gonna bother changing that band in between each workout. <laughs> What's up, four more, come on. Squeeze on that bottom two, nice. Now ready, hold it here, come on up. Squeeze that bum nice and tight. So we're adding a hinge, a row, up and squeeze. So a deadlift, row, good. Soften in those knees, coming down. Feet are about hip distance apart. Now when those weights come into your waist, you're squeezing your shoulder blades right down your spine. Dollar bill now is against the wall behind you. So butt goes against the wall. And then you want to clench with your butt cheeks, grab that dollar bill, uh, right there, yeah? Ready? Down, seven rows, go down. Yeah, pull. Keep those abs nice and tight, you guys, or you're gonna hurt your back. Come on, three more. Can you tap those toes? One more, come on up, last set seven, go, hinge, pull. So like if your ponytail were down your spine, your shoulder blades are hugging that ponytail. Ow, one more time, come on up, nice, just your deadlifts, down two, up two, squeeze tight. What I love about deadlifts too, you're not only working, but you get a nice stretch. Think of pushing your tailbone up to the side as you're pressing those butt cheeks back. Down one, up three, pull, 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 squeeze tight. Down one, up three, nice. Two more, please go, down. Ow, feeling good. Last one, we're gonna change the count. Down three, go, go. Three, 
two, up one. Squeeze tight. Let's push into that wall. Smack that dumb billy out. Come on. One more time. Nice. Ready? We're going back to our squats. Right here we go. Down two, up two. Sit back. We're going to take this right up into an overhead press. Down two, up two. Yeah. Breathe in, breathe out. Tempo go. Go. Come on. But nice and tight. So our heart rate definitely comes up because we're doing two things at the same time. So yeah, that's why those heart rates come up. Breathing's a little heavier. Ready? Just the arms. Go. Down, up. So those arms facing each other. Feel the top of your shoulder, yes. Oh, four more. That's feeling good. Two. Ready, both arms up. Right arm only, go down. Three, come on. One more time. Left arm go, right here. So get a balance, right? Use your core, none of that crap. Ready, both arms, legs, two counts. Come down, press up. Squeeze your bum. Down two, up two, nice. Double go. Pick it up. One more time. Ready? Arms only. Go. Eight. They start the fatigue. Top of the shoulders, yeah. Mine is screaming. Mine are like, F you, girl. Come on. But that's okay. We fight. We get stronger. Hold it right down. But four. Push. So we don't quit when we're tired. We quit when we're done. We're not done. Last time. Four. Ow. Last two. Awesome. Ditch one weight. Awesome job, you guys. All right, so listen. I'm going to try to stay on the screen. We're going to get down into a little crab walk. So you're low in, the, in that squat, heavy in your heels. Your ceiling's right here. We're going to walk out. Don't hit that ceiling. Left side. So notice the band. It starts off tight, gets tighter, tight. Tighter, tight, okay? Nothing loose. Try to rip that band, get lower, lower, eight. Come on. Left side. Knees, toes forward. Lower, yes, is that ceiling starting to collapse? How you breathing, heavy? Because you're working. Four more, somebody say yeah. Come on. Ow. What's up, what's up, Saturday? Ow, fit strength. Last one. Ow. Ready? Down and pulse. Go. Three, two, one up. Boom. Ah, there's the break. Come on. Three pulses. Up one. Last time. Nice job. Down and hold for three. Halfway up. Down, hold three. Halfway up. How your legs? Hold three. Halfway. Last one, you guys. Down. Awesome. Woo! Right here, shake it out, shake it out. Nice job. Grab that other weight, bend with those legs. So we're gonna kind of flush that away and get into a reverse row. Feet are gonna be a little closer together, more of a narrow stance. We're down two, we fly two, we come up, squeeze tight. Take it again slow. Inhaling, exhaling, inhaling, ready, tempo go. We're down. Nice. So even though we have more of a narrow stance, there's still a baby bend on those knees. Arms nice and wide. Work in that back. What do you say? Yeah? Heavy heels. Stay focused. Oh man. Here's two. Ready, set. We're gonna take this down seven flies. Go down seven. Make sure you can handle those toes. Shoulder blades on your spine. Ow. Belly nice and tight. One more time. Come on up. Second round. Seven, go. Now if you need to option out, just go one at a time. That's totally cool, okay? Finish. Three. Last one. One more, one more. Come on up. Nice. How'd that go, you guys? Good? Keep that band drop. One weight. Second round. Get nice and low. Crab walks. Right side. Left side. Try to rip that band. So our focus here is on our outer thighs, our hips and glutes. Yes. And remember we're not popping up. We're not popping up and down. 
that ceiling is collapsing and coming down lower on top of us. So we need to really melt into those heels. Heels floor, come on. Left side, go. Really take a big step. Two more, my house, my house. Last one, how's your booty? Yeah, come on up, nice. Ditch that band, you're like, oh my God, thank God. <laughs> now your legs feel like spaghetti. All right, we're gonna go into a plie. So how do we find that turnout? Squeeze your bum together. Uh, get your feet together rather, rather parallel. Parallel. Squeeze your butt cheeks tight, and you're gonna find a natural turnout. Okay? Turnout comes from those hips. Now take those legs wide, keeping that turnout so that when we come into that plie, our knees track our toes. Let's go. Two counts down, two up. So essentially. Our back is sliding against the wall behind us, right? We have a nice long spine, tailbone drops, and we come up. So I want you to pretend like you have a beach ball. Pretend like you have a beach ball between your inner thighs. So when you come up, you're trying to pop that beach ball right there. Stay where you are, you guys. At the same time, take these outer thighs, push them to the wall behind you, all right? So push, open up that hip joint. Stay with your weights, stay with that. Open up, yeah, feel the difference now. Open up those hips, push those outer thighs back. Take it down and pulse, go, eight. So really focusing on those inner thighs. Ready, down, up, halfway, go, down, halfway. Building strength, drive those outer thighs to the back wall. Spine nice and straight for four. Yeah, you can, hold those weights right here. Ready, come on up, front raise, go right, go left. Bring this in a bit. Right, give those legs a break. Now option one, stay right here. Option one right here. Shaking someone's hand, right? Option two, both arms go. Up, down. Look what we're not doing. All right, none of that. Abs tight. Gotta pause, gotta pause. One more time. Right, left, go. Shaking someone's hand, opening up a door. Palms space in, thumbs up. No higher than shoulder height. How are you doing? I think you're doing good. I think just because you're here, you're doing good. Two up, three down, right here. Yeah, so that was one up of both ways and three down. That was a lot of numbers to say though. So you got it on the second round, right? One up, three down, one count up, boom, three down. Four more times, there you can, boom. Oh, so notice on this negative response right here, how much harder that is, yeah? Working against gravity. It's good shit right there. Yeah, it is. Getting stronger. Right, left, go, tempo. Boom. Want to avoid this, right? If you start to get sloppy, guys, you got to go to lighter weight. We don't want to, we don't want to risk our form for weight, okay? Both arms up, one, down, three, go. Down slow, slow, go again. So never compromising form for weight, okay? Form is what we got. We get sloppy, that's how we get injured. One more, boom. Now ready? Turn out, plies, go, down, up, right here. So those knees track the toes. They don't go past them. So if you kind of look down your inner thigh, you should be able to see your two big toes. All right, that's how you kind of know your turnout's proper. Stay down and pulse here, three, two, halfway. Down, the three, tension, right? Inner thighs and those glutes, open up those hips. Keep pressing those outer thighs back. Now ready? Down, up, tempo, halfway, up, go down. Ow, come on. Open those hips more. Really press those outer thighs to the back wall, four. Belly zipped up nice and tight. One more time, you guys. Ready, pulse, go. Three, halfway up. Keep that tension. I know your legs are shaking. Mine are screaming. My legs are dropping up bombs. One more time, please, pulse. Ow, let's come all the way up. Two counts, go. Down, press, nice. Now, as you're pushing through those heels, zip those inner thighs up together. So what else does that mean? We're squeezing those glutes super tight. Now, ready? Drop down one, hold the three. Up one time, push. Drop down, three. Up one, woo! Drop it, press it. One more, please. This is gonna be it. Down three counts, slow. Halfway up. Ow! 
We're in for out of thighs. They push them. They push it back there, yeah. One more. Kristen, what's up, girl? Come on up. Ready? Go right two. Left two. Lean in those legs, huh? Up two. Down two. Stand tall. Stand proud. Up. No higher than shoulder height. Ready? Both arms. One up, three down. Go. Boom. Down three. I love that. Look. Down slow. Use control. Nice job. Come on. You got four more? Yeah, you do. Work the front of those shoulders. Come on. Two more, two more. So see how heavy I'm breathing? I'm working with you guys. Single this out right, left. Right? So it's your workout. I'm with you. So I know just what you're feeling. Four more. We're in this together, team. One more time. Great. All right? Thank goodness. Drop one weight. So we've hit our reverse flies. We've hit our rows. We've hit our sides. We've hit our fronts. We've hit our tops. All right, let's get wide. We're in a row right here. So we're just driving into that right heel. Now we're only using one weight. I would kind of suggest maybe something a little on the lighter side because we're gonna add a little push off right there. Come down, row it. Out, pull. Land softly on that heel. Remember, sheet of glass, don't break it for. Just kind of keeping that back warm. One more time. Take it down. Pulse it. Go. We're going to switch hands. Hold it here. Go four, three. Left side. Go. You're down. Go. Option one. Option two. Land soft. Yeah. Ah. Right leg straight. So now you're feeling this little power. When we add this little plyometric work and we land nice and soft, we're adding power into that muscle, into those legs. Here's three. Squeeze tight. Ready, down, and pulse go. Eight. Ready to switch. Four more. Ready? Right side tempo go. Come down. Row. Side body. Heavy in that heel. Stay with it, guys. Down and up. Down and up. So see how it's still almost like a squat? So you're pushing back on that heel, keeping that left leg straight. Down and up. Here's four. Ow! No pulsing. One more time. Switch it, go. Down up, right here. Do you notice two? Oops, maybe. There we go. Maybe one leg has a little more flexibility than the other, right? So remember, I say this all the time in every of my fit workouts. When we're tight, if we're tight on the inner thigh, it's not that we're not strong enough for that lunge, it's because that muscle's too tight. So it lowers, limits our range of motion. Two more. Nice. What's up, how we doing? Hey Colleen, hi honey, you in New Hampshire? What are you up to? All right, so grab the middle of that leg to break. Grab your weights. Grab a drink. Cheers, team. All right, so again, flush out those legs. We're coming down to up to. I want you to take your left foot behind you. So our focus is on our right leg, and you're gonna dial, I'm over-exaggerating this, but dial your pinky and toes down. So your left foot, those pinky toes are dialed down. We're gonna take this into an SLDL, single leg deadlift. So, really hard for me to do and talk at the same time. So we're trying to look for one straight line. From your ear, shoulders, hips, right to that back leg. You can keep that left foot down for a little kickstand. Keep going, two down, two up. Find your focal point for balance, and just imagine touching the wall behind you. Now remember, we want those pinky toes dialed down. Let's go down and hold right here. So you're either here in your kickstand, or you're floating up that leg. We're gonna reverse fly right here. All right, now remember, please, in order to work harder, you gotta work smarter. So, we're balancing on that right leg. 
you need your kickstand, take a kickstand. Four more, four more. Oh my God, how's that right leg though? Last two, one more, break. Ow! Shake it out, left side. Dial those right pinky toes down so those hips stay square. Go, two counts down, get your hinge. So again, the idea to dial the pinky toes down, look at me, is so that this doesn't happen. All right, shoulders, hips square. Try it out. Down two, up two. So find your focal point. Down two, balancing out, inhaling down. And I'm gonna give props to everybody out there who's working on a rug because it's a more instable surface, so it's a little hotter. Now take this down, pull. We did our flies, now row, pull. So this is our second set of back work. Watch your form team, squeeze. Shoulder blades towards your spine. Heavy in that left heel. You're kickstanding to keep that back straight. Or you're coming into that single leg deadlift. SLDL for four. Come on. One more. Come on up. Oh, holy booty. Drop one weight. Oh, did I mention this is like a lot of booty work today? Did I neglect to say that? <laughs> All right. So one weight's dropped. Right here. Sumo squats. Feel a little wider than hips. Just like a basic squat. Down two. Up and squeeze. So remember those plies we just did. And we wanted to really crush that beach ball. Remember our plies, we wanted to crush the beach ball right there. So same idea, except now with your sumo, it's almost like a basic squat. We're dropping our hips and coming up. We're our plie, back was straight. All right, let's go one more time. Down two, up two. Take it down and pulse, go. Three, heavy heels, halfway up, go. Down three, abs tight, so we're protecting that back, go. Pulse, pulse, halfway. Now you see why we needed those hips nice and warm, right? What do you say? What do you say? A couple more? Huh? No? You want to keep going? No one's going to talk? Tempo down up halfway to go. Right here. You're like, F you. How can I talk? I'm trying to work, right? Lower lip. Come on, team. We're in it together. We got this. Last two. Last one. All the way up. Ow. Nice. Grab both weights. We're going to go biceps. I'm going to go a little heavier to the end lift. And you can always drop down lighter. Feet hip distance apart. Hammer girl, two times. Up, down two. Good. Now, if you want to take it into a split stance, that's fine. But you just want to make sure that back goes off the floor. Those elbows remain under your shoulders. Right, left go. Boom. Come down. What are we not doing? None of that, okay? Fire up. Cup of coffee on your head. You're looking straight ahead. Game on, biatches. Let's go. Here's eight. Yeah, all you do is two. All right? Come on. Big squeeze. Ah, welcome to the gun show. One more, everybody. Both arms up, one down, three, go. Boom. Down slow. Ow. Go shot it. Pull. I'm going to go ahead and switch my stance because I like to kind of be even. One more time. Ready? Right, left, go. Tempo. Go show it. It's your birthday. That's like the only room I know. And I know you can sit the body. Come on. Boom. Ah. How are they feeling? It's time to burn out. Four more sets. Come on. Yeah, you can. Right, with single note. Ow. We got two more sets, go. Last one, right? Ready? Both arms up, one go. Boom, down slow. Exhale it. Pull. Remember not to rock those hips. Boom, down slow. Take it. Up, down slow. We have four, yes. Boom, down slow. Go. Stomach nice and tight. Two more, please. Oh my God, those biceps. One more time. Last one, break. Nice job, you guys. Dip those weights. Actually, let's keep one. So if you start your sumos with that lower weight like I did, let's try a little heavier now. All right, slight turnout. Remember, when we come up, we're screwing those 
thigh bones into our hip joint. So boom, we're sucking those inner thighs in tight, squeezing our bottom. Ready? Down two, up two. So imagine like a corkscrew right there, squeezing your bum super tight as you're coming up. Drop your booty, drop it like it's hot, and come up squeeze tight. Dollar bill back there, pick it up. Squeeze. Now ready? We're going tempo down up, halfway go, go, halfway, no break, yeah. Think of pushing the mat away from you in both directions. So you're really working purposeful here. Try to really push away from your hips in both directions, down and hold the three. How strong are you? Halfway up. You showed up, come on. You know you're strong. Inside and outside, hold it, get those legs wide. Make sure those knees track those toes. Come on up, down, three, ow, halfway, down, three. So what do you notice? There's no break. So that's like, holy crap, man. Keep those legs open, come on. Thighs back, come on up. Last time, down slow. Three, two, halfway, down slow, ah, halfway. Hips open, outer thighs, back wall, one more time. Ready, all the way up, oh, good for you. Shake it out, shake it out. We're coming down to the ground. Keep your weights by your side. Make sure the band is with you. All right, you guys, so you're gonna grab that band. You're gonna put it above your knees. Isn't this fun? So all that hip flexion that we did, like this stuff, that's all hip flexion. Every time like you sit down and stuff. So now we're gonna get into some bridges and really open everything up. We're gonna start, I just wanna make sure you guys can see me. We're gonna start down in our back. Now to find your form, relax your hands down. Just walk your heels back. So your middle finger can kind of touch your heels. From there, just keep your weight by your side. We're lifting up and down. So now these hip extensions open up those hips, right? Our butt taps the floor come down. Now ready, up and pulse, go. For three, two, down, one. And what do you notice with the band? If you aren't strong enough here, what's gonna happen? Your knees are gonna wanna like walk together, right? So we keep that tension, slight turn over your toes. Ten ball go. You want more challenge? Grab your weights. Right there. So now you get a little more weight to press up. Why not, right? We're here. We're working. We're sweaty hot messes. Two. All right, team. Up and ball. Go, go. Eight. Press. Heels heavy. Toes can wiggle. Ow. Weight on those shoulder blades. Eight more. Come on, come on. Get higher, higher. Ow. Four. Up, down, ten. Go, go. Lift. Whew. So I gotta tell you, so if any of you have stayed with me since Pit Fix, this is like really challenging because we're already kind of spent. You guys that are just starting this bit strength with me, try to see if a fit ride after. Up and hold. Three, down one, up and hold. So you can make a little double out of it. Our fit rides only going to be for 30 minutes. This is our 55 zero minute workout. Press, now ready? Take those weights with you. Hold your bridge, we're down to fly. Up and squeeze. So those hips stay open. You're gonna feel that contraction in your glutes, right? Even those hamstrings. How shaky is your bum? Take this tempo, go. Eight. Hold. Now remember, those weights need to tap together, but not smash. So use control and pretend like there's an egg between your weights. So when you come up, you're not smashing egg all over your face. Get those hips high and go four. Boom. Elbows tap. Squeeze. Hug that beach ball. Now bolt and throw move. Just pulse eight. Hips up, hips up. Booty everywhere. Go for it. Oh man. Now ready? Take it down. Just that chest. Down two. Up two. Ready? Legs up. Bad backs. Keep your feet on the floor. We're inhaling down. Exhale and up. Let's get that back core. Yeah? Get that stomach. Now let's make sure your lower back stays pressed into the floor, okay? Your weights come on your chest like you're hugging a beach ball. So what's going on? We get this stretch and we contract. How to do in top? I'm with you. I work with you. So, can you make your legs a little wider? Feel those outer thighs? Ow! <laughs> like really? Do we really need to feel them anymore? <laughs> One more time. 
Ready? Weight drop. Just your legs. Down. Heels together. Three. Point and lift up. One. Heels flex. Point and lift up. One. Heels flex. Point lift up. One. Heels flex. Ow. Keep going, team. Down. Three. Point. Boom. Lower. Nice. So now we look like little ballerinas coming down in first position. Isn't that cool? Inner thighs zipped up nice and tight. Down and hold here. Hold here. Up one. Go. Down, hold. Lower back into the floor. Down, hold. Ow. Use common sense. If you need to keep on from the floor, keep on from the floor. If these weights are killing you, then get rid of them. Remember, you gotta work smarter to work harder. Come on. Down, hold. Ow, how low can you go without that back action? Last one. Ready? Great. Come on up. We're flipping this right over. How are we going? Welcome to the party. Turn your faces this way. Just because my mic is on the side, so I think like you can hear me better. We're going into push-ups. Shaka, right? What do you think? We're going to go get away doing a workout with me without doing push-ups? What are you crazy? I should give you that moon struck. Snap out of it, right? All right. So, you don't want to do push-ups, stay in your back, just like we did our thighs, and do a basic chest press. That's totally cool. All right, but let's get down to those push-ups. Keep that band where it is. We're going to cross our ankles, lift our feet. We're going to exhale, two up, two down. So that back is nice and straight. And you want to really think of pushing. So you want to feel your pecs left right here. Boom, yeah. All right, take a tempo go. Up and down. Now notice as you're doing tempo, maybe your range of motion is shortened, and that's totally normal, because you're going a little quicker. Two more, now ready? Hold this, right here, hold it. For two, push up for two. Inhale, hold two, exhale up two. Two more, please. Hold, press, zip up your thighs. Every muscle action is on. Two more, hold, Last one. Oh, welcome to the body. Now ready? Two down slow. Boom. Up slow. Ow. Are we finding a deeper range of motion or what? Two more. You don't have to answer that. I'm finding maybe like about a centimeter more. But you know what? That's better than nothing. Last two. And my arms are shaking. One more time. Ready? Tempo go. Here's eight. I can barely get down. Keep going, you guys. Only because I got I did fit fix before this. So if you guys have done fit fix with this, with me before this, holy crap those arms, right? Let's do another set of eight. I'll try to go with you. I might go slower. No judgment out there. No one's judging us. Four more. We showed up for us, right? Here's two. Ow. Great. Holy crap. Cheers to that shit, huh? All right. So we did some bicep work. We're gonna go into triceps. You're gonna grab either one or two weights. So your option on these triceps with two weights are gonna look like this. We're gonna keep on that band, why not? We're gonna toe heel those feet out a little bit, why not? So we're gonna go here, right into a little, so bring those palms towards your ears. Almost like a skull crusher, except our palms are facing each other. So those weights come by our ears and into the sky. Now, if that's not cool, because you just your arms are spent, and you want to work smarter, not harder, you're going to do one weight. So look at me. I want you to give me a thumbs up. Thumbs up. So as you're coming down, your thumbs are going to touch those eyebrows by your forehead, and then up, because I don't want that weight to crash your head. Okay? Ready? Let's go. Two down. Elbows facing that wall in front of you. So those thumb bleeds and those pinkies. All right, so listen. This is almost too easy. Let's get that bridge. Get up on those shoulder planes. Down two, up two. Now remember, you have a slight turn up on those toes. You're driving through those heels and you're having a shit ton of fun right now. Now ready? Just your right arm. Go for eight. Go. Come on. Press. Breathe in, breathe out. Now obviously, if you're using one weight, you can take this to both arms, and then maybe drop the weight and break on this side. Ready, left, go. Come on, hips up. Squeeze your bum. Breathe in, breathe out. Ow. Feel that tricep here. Go four. 
nice and strong. How are you doing, team? Ready? Two counts, both arms. Down two. Up two. Push. Ow. Breathing in. Breathing out. That feels so good. So good, so good. One more time for those triceps. Now ready? Drop your weight. Pulse this up right here. Right here. All right, we're gonna really get into those hips and glutes. Let's toe heel and speed up a little more. With that said, knees need to track the toes, remember? We don't want those knees smashing together. Now ready? Pull this up and push out, 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 out. Keep those hips up. Coughing on that pelvis. So it's kind of slanted, but we're keeping it steady so we're not rocking it around, okay? Get those hips up higher, push your arms down. Push. The straight those arms and the you're pushing your triceps and your fire up. Eight, seven, six, come on. In those heels, you can wiggle those toes. Push those arms down, harder go. Eight, seven, come on, come on, push, push. Last set. And break. Ow. Come on up. Hands behind your thighs. Pull this right up. Get to all fours. We're almost done. Choose a heavier weight. We're gonna go one arm at a time for those triceps. So let's go a little heavier, if you can. If not, no worries, okay? Left hand on your shoulder. Right arm, elbow by shoulder height, go. Press, now this is. Some of us with, with uh, elbow issues, this might not feel good. So then don't use the weight, and you're just gonna press up and down. But listen, you gotta go from length, like you're trying to touch the wall behind you. Lengthen out. So for that triceps to flex and work, you can't have a bent elbow. You're not gonna work your tricep like that. So even on those kickbacks, you wanna make sure your arm is straight, all right? Come on, eight more, push, ow. Back nice and straight. Belly up, four. That's feeling good, yeah. Go two more, awesome. Other side, take it, but eight. First thing anyways. All right, so that head, neck, and shoulder blades lined up with your spine. Right wrist, right under your shoulder. Boom, get that flexion. Get that arm straight. Not those face in the back wall, team. We got one more set, you with me, yes? Come on, come on. Come on, little boy, come on. Three. Two, three, up on your knees, straight arms. So we're gonna find our friends right here that just went with those arms straight. Now we're gonna be like, holy crap, you guys, we're working hard, right? See, I wasn't full of crap. So a cup of coffee on top of your head, and you're pressing those arms back. Now look, it, we're not just pressing them up, it's up and in, in, up and in, up and in, thumbs toward each other. I don't want you hyperextending, but we cannot have those elbows bent, okay? Shoulder blades drawing down and together toward the spine. Abs are super, super tight. Eight more, let's go. Can you get longer? Touch that wall behind you. Yeah, 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 come on. In, push, push, and reach. Here's four, three, two, ow, right? Come on back down. Awesome, we're gonna hit those other thighs one more time and then take it to our core. All right, we're not gonna use a weight yet. I'll kind of talk you through why and stuff like that. But down on your back first. And don't worry, I didn't forget that we had one more set of push-ups. I didn't forget, don't you worry. All right, <laughs> so remember those fingertips, middle fingers barely touching your heels, so those arms are nice and long. All right, get those hips up. Now I want you to get real straight in the arms. Push everything down into the floor. And pulse, out, out, out. Keep those hips up. Weight on your shoulder blades. Push those arms down even harder, you guys. Feel that? You should be able to feel that. Those arms should be super straight. Those triceps should be screaming. Navel drawn to your spine. Can you get your hips up higher? Yes or yes? Ow. Keep pulsing, I know. I told you I'm with you. Hold this, get up higher, a little higher. Just a little more, just a little more. Take those arms up, pulse this up, go. Eight, seven, six, five. We got this, come on. Very last two sets. One more time, oh man, here we go. Very last 
one ring. Ow! Nice job. Take those legs up. Option one, you're right here. We're pressing. Out, in. Bad backs. Your feet are down. Okay? Right there. Option two. Wide legs. Listen, the idea is keeping me over your hips. So look at my legs. We don't want them down here because they'll hurt your lower back. We're going for outer thighs, okay? So we want to soft bend in the knees. You can bring your legs up, you can keep them bent. Whatever you want to do, just make it work. Ready, out, and pulse it. Go, eight, seven. Put your hand by your band so it's not rolling down your thigh. Squeeze, squeeze. Come on, press out, press out. Pointing those toes. For four, three. Now, flex your feet, keep on pulsing. Go, eight, feel a little difference, right? Yeah, come on. Try to stretch and rip that band. So again, flexibility comes into play. If those in the thighs are tight, you limit our range of motion. Woo! Let's go. Down, point up. Flex down, point up. Rip that band. Now we're gonna take it halfway. Flex, point, so we're not losing tension in that band. Do not lose tension. Keep those abs nice and tight. Very last four. Flex down, point up. Three. Ow, can you get lower? Can you get lower? Everybody say yeah! And break. Ditch that band. You're like, keep on. Come on up. Flip it over. Now you're in New York. So we got 10 minutes. We're going to get back into our chest. We're going to hit that core. Get those obliques. Call it a day. Or you're going to join me for Fit Ride for 30 minutes. All right. We're ready, set. So we're going push-ups. You don't want to do push-ups. You want to go on your back. You want to chest press. I. I, Colleen. Ready? Go. Two down. Two up. All right, team. Straight back tempo. Go. So just use all you can to get through this. We're going to go three sets. Now ready, slow down two counts. Down two. And you will find that when you go slower, you can get a little further. And you get more time. Two up. Come on, fix that. Stronger, stronger. Tempo go. Boom. It's okay if your range of motion short it out. Going for the burn on four. You with me? I'm with you. Come on, two down, we go. Oh, rest. Feel that chest come, right? Oh my God. Down to, up to Jamie. How you doing? Are you laughing at me? I didn't fall yet. Take the tempo, go. Oh, I can help it get down. I'm gonna take a break right here. You keep going, down, up. Down, up, now I'm with this. Here's four, let's go. Oh, here's two. Oh, and I'm going to say it one more time if you guys are just joining. I just got through doing tip fix, so that's why my, my arms are like spaghetti, okay? Flip this over. We're going balls to the wall for like seven minutes, all four. So I'm going to stay here, right here, on top of your sit bones. Sit up nice and tall. Look at me. None of this. All right, tall and proud. So even when we hinge back, look at me. None of this. All right, right there. So behind those sit bones, you can float your legs. We exhale, we inhale. So let's go, be sit, breathe out, in. Use your stomach to pull yourselves up. And notice how strong you are when you're coming down. If you want more challenge for balance, Bring those hands out a little wider, or even out, right here. So, as I get stuck. So, as I'm still getting stuck, I can't talk in movies, just watch. You can kind of hollow out more. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Let's go. Four. Come on. One more. Woo! Flip it over. Let's get our plank on. I'm going to face this this way so you can see where my knees are going. 
All right, so hands on the shoulders. Nice tight plank. Get up on it. Ready, set, Spider-Man's. Right knee, right elbow. Left knee, left elbow. So I want you guys to notice, none of this, see this? We're not doing that. Everything's straight. Inner thigh looks at the floor. Eyes and your elbows spiral to the front of the run. So this is awesome to be in hip joints. Open foot right up. Really flex that foot. And just imagine getting that knee toward that opposite elbow. What's up? Ow. Oblique there. Stay with the team. Four more. Three more. Two. Now ready. Right knee, left elbow, we rotate. Come center, rotate, center. Come on, bring out your waist. That spine straight, and we're staying within the frame of our body. All right, so imagine the spine like a rotisserie stick, and your torso is the chicken. You're cooking that chicken. Rotisserie stick, twisting, come on. I know those shoulders are screaming. One more time, and hold for four. Abs tight, three, two, break. Flip it back over. And this one, so I feel like, no, it's not one. So listen, I want you to pretend like someone's stepping on your toes. We're gonna inhale ourselves down. I'll move over, arms overhead. We're gonna come up and reach for that person that's standing on our toes, reach for the fingertips. All right, all right? So start at your end position. So here's our end position. Let's go. We're down. Take those heels in. Breathe in. Out. Oh. One vertebra at a time. Coming all the way down. And reaching up. So listen, you want to make sure those heels ah, aren't doing that, okay? Right here. So if you're home, and if you even want to stick your toes underneath your couch, that's fine. And you're not just coming up. Watch. Create length. Reach. Get long right there. Come on. One bird over the time. Now we're going to go off beat. I want you to bang out as many as you can. Right here, guys. 20 seconds. Still using proper form. Still keeping those heels down. 15, come on. That's three, two, break. That should feel good. Come on into a play. Ready, set. From your plank. Option one, you can give me spinal balance from your knees. Option two, of course, we're going to go into a high one. Hands a little close to the shoulders, feet on the line of the hips. Right arm, left arm. Off on your lower back, don't spill it. Stretch, cutting in that arm, eat a height. Touch the wall in front of you. And there's four, how are you doing with this? Staying straight, no way on. Now ready, slow down. Right arm, left leg. Oh, that's okay. Stay for the, um, was that the class I fell on? Stay for the ride if you can. All right, so guys, get a quad stretch. 
We did so much leg work. All right, so we've got fit rides starting at 10, which means we're starting at like 10 or three. <laughs> Take it to the other side. So my cute little pants, I always gotta give a shout out to all my people who send me these great clothes. These are from Zaya. They're wicked cute and I love their logo. It's got a cute little corner. It's got like a cute little, check it out, like a little half moon. See that? Yeah? Really cute. So I'll be giving um, I'll be giving my friend Riley a shout out on Instagram and Facebook. Take it up and over. And you can order them through her. They're great. You know that I wouldn't wear anything I don't like. Especially you call me. You know how much of a a clothes snob that I am, right? Take it down. Tell me, it is though, so true. Feet flat, back flat down. I've had companies send me stuff and I give it a whirl, like I give it a try. And I'm like, mm, uh-uh. But thank you, you know? One more time. Come on up, only the best for the best, right? Only the best for you guys. Take those arms up, squeeze your bum nice and tight. Tight, 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 because you gotta support that back as we come up and over. So again, you guys should be proud of yourselves. I've had a really bad week in my little roller coaster bipolar ride. So yesterday was my first day back because I, I just was paralyzed all week long. I couldn't do nothing. Yeah, and you know, I don't care. I share with you because I want to help you. I don't want people to feel like me. That sucks. Take those arms out. So that's why I do these free workouts for you guys, especially during all this COVID times because like it can get so stressful. We can become so depressed and I don't want you to feel that. I feel it enough and I don't like it. I don't want you to feel like that. So instead we create these happy endorphins. We create these endorphins and they help us be happy, right? Kristen, I'll see you later, babe. All right, so I'll see you on the bike. Jesse, I'll see you on the bike. All right, 10 o'clock. Thank you so much, you guys. Remember to please share my page with your friends, families, coworkers, or even people you don't like. Maybe share it with them. Maybe if they worked out, they'd be happier and then you'd maybe like them, right? <laughs> but just share my page, hit me up on Instagram. And I'll see you at 10 o'clock with it ride. Bye.